Hello everyone and welcome to the linuxin.com. In this video, we'll show you how to run a memtest in Ubuntu 20.04. We'll also explain more about memtester command line utility which can be used to check RAM errors. So without any further ado, let's get started. Random access memory or RAM is an important part of any computer system. If you set up a new Ubuntu environment or VPS virtual private server and you do not have any idea about the internal memory details of your system such as how much RAM is installed and used on your system, then you can easily test all information about your computer's memory using a memtest software program. Memtests are memory test utilities designed to test your computer's RAM for errors. There are 86 plus memtest programs included by default in most Linux distributions including Ubuntu 20.04. If a memtest program is not included in your distribution, then you can create a portable test drive from the USB from which to boot and run the memtest. This utility writes the test pattern of memory addresses, reads data, and compares for errors. To perform the memtest, Ubuntu 20.04 must be installed on your system, and the memtest 86 plus option should be available in the grub menu. We'll run Ubuntu on VirtualBox to demonstrate the grub menu process. Performing a memory test in Ubuntu is easy compared to other distributions. As you may know, memtest86 plus runs without an operating system. Therefore, you must have access to grub menu in Ubuntu. Turn on or restart your system and hold down the shift key to access the grub menu. The list of options will be displayed in the grub menu. Using the arrow key, select the memtest86 plus option. Press enter key and run the memtest86 plus program. The test will start to run automatically on your system and continue until and unless you quit the running process by pressing the escape key. It is best practice to run the test for one full pass. We have edited the details about the test in red boxes. Well, you have now successfully executed the memtest on your Ubuntu system. This is like a game to check if any error are detected or if your system restarts. It is recommended to run the memtest for many passes because sometimes an error might not be detected until a second pass. Each pass may take many hours or days to complete depending on how much memory is installed on your system. So it is recommended to run the memory test at the end of the day to obtain the best result. If your system has a large volume of memory and crashing is infrequent then may be a good idea to run the test over the weekend. If you have error correcting code ECC memory, then you can easily get errors with doing one pass only. It will correct all errors on its own. If you have the time to perform a second pass for error detection, in this case, we recommend you to run memory tests using memtester utility. Memtester is a command line utility that you can use to check your RAM for errors. The memtester utility is not installed on the Ubuntu system by default, but you can install the utility using the command sudo apt install memtester. Once the memtester is installed on your system, you can run the memtester command on your system to check the RAM for errors. To check the RAM for errors, you need to run this memtester command sudo memtester size and iteration. In this command, size is the amount of the memory that you want to allocate and iteration is the number of times to run the command to check for errors or the number of passes. For example, to run a memtester command for memory size 200 MB for one iteration, the command will be like this. After entering the command, the output should display on the terminal like this. So from this video, you learned how to run memtest86 plus in Ubuntu 20.04. This feature can be useful if your system has been crashed many times. Before filing any bug report, first you should perform the memtest. Moreover, you also learn how to run a memory test using the memtester command line utility. Hopefully, after watching this video, you are now able to perform a memory test for your own system. Thank you so much. See you in some other video on linuxin.com.